Hi, my name is Paul Dubuque, and today we're going to show you how easy it is to sell the same item in different quantities on e-commerce storefronts connected to Acumatica. Let's consider this filter that we sell for $9.99 each on BigCommerce and Shopify. What if we wanted to offer the same filter, not just individually, but offer it in a box of six on BigCommerce and a box of ten on Shopify? We're going to make a couple simple changes to the item in Acumatica, then to each of the e-commerce storefronts. First, in Acumatica, we add two additional units of measure to the item. We add a box that converts to a quantity of six eaches, and we add box 10 that converts to a quantity of 10 eaches. Next, we click over to the cross-reference tab and add a global alternate type for each of the new units of measure, and add one for the individual sale as well. While the last one is not necessary, it's good practice to keep things consistent. Take note of the alternate ID you assign as these will be used in the e-commerce stores in a few moments. You can call them anything you wish. I added a dash one, a dash six, and a dash 10 to the original ID. This makes it easy to understand and add some consistency. You should also note the UOM, or unit of measure for each. They match up to what we set up in our first step. Now let's move to the big commerce store setup. Navigate to products, then view that item, and then view the variation section. Select add variant option, for the option name, enter quantity. For the type, select drop down. For the values, enter individual and box of six. The two new variants are now displayed below, where you can edit the SKU and the price for each. Change the SKU for individual to filter dash one and leave the price. Change the SKU for box of six to filter dash six. Change the price to whatever you wish to sell the box of six filters for. Let's enter $55. You have the option to add a new image. Perhaps you have one that shows the six or the box. Let's just leave it and use the item's default. And we'll press save. Now when we look at this filter in the Big Commerce store, we see a drop-down list showing the individual and the box of six. Let's place the order for the box of six and complete the order. Back in Acumatica, you can see the sales order for a quantity of one box at $55, just as we expected. The shipping department now knows to ship one box that has six filters in it to our customer. Now let's set up the box of 10 in Shopify. In the Shopify store settings, under product, select the product called filter and scroll to options and select this product has options. Select size as the option name, then enter individual and then box of 10 as option values and then press done. This added the two variants as options below. Click on individual and change the SKU to filter dash one and select done. Now click on box of 10 and change the price to $92 and change the SKU to filter dash 10 and select done. Now when we look at this filter in the Shopify store, you see a drop down list that shows individual and box of 10. Let's place an order for the box of 10 and complete the order. In Acumatica, you see the sales order for one box of 10 at the price of $92, just as we planned. And the shipping department knows to ship one box of 10 filters to the customer. With just a couple simple steps, we offer the same item in multiple units of measure on two different e-commerce stores, giving you and your customers more options, all using our standard e-commerce connector. Thank you for watching. If you have any additional questions, please feel free to reach out to your local Acumatica reseller or contact us at info at